2021 was a record year for calls for the Des Moines Fire Department, and now they're looking for more firefighters to join their ranks. And we're not just talking about people who have experience in this line of work either. Lots of people can apply. In fact, there are two fire academies coming up. There's the conventional track and an accelerated path as well. And here to tell us all about it, we have Des Moines Fire Chief John Tekip. You know, usually you're out there, you're, you're trying to bring in recruits. Bigger sense of urgency to it this time, Chief. Tell us about that. Well, we are as we are as busy as we've ever been, and uh, as part of it, one of the impacts of the pandemic was a delay in the hiring. And so, well, the strategy that we came up with is really a two-track process where people can um, join the Des Moines Fire Department. One of those is are is people that already have the fire certifications and the paramedic training, and the other is our our customary the the usual hiring process that we have. And so. Um, we're taking applications right now, and it's the same application period for everyone. And then we'll get to a point where that will uh, go into two different paths. And those who are certified um, will make a class of them, get them started, and then we'll come back to the others um, and make have that second class. So we'll essentially have kind of a cascading uh, training environment here, which will allow us to recoup some of the the numbers of firefighters that are in the stations, but it provides a lot of opportunity, both for those who have experience in the fire service and doing EMS work, as well as those, they're, they're just the right uh, kind of folks to come be great public servants as firefighters, but they haven't had the opportunity yet um, to get that training. And so we're gonna provide that for both. We know people are, are hearing this. There are lots of people ever since they were a little kid, dreamed of being a firefighter. And so this is sparking some imagination. Talk about some of the biggest misconceptions about being an actual real life firefighter. Probably the, the best one is, you know, we are the fire department, but um, fighting fire is actually a pretty small percentage of the work that we do. It's vital and it's timely and those kinds of things. But most of the work that we do is EMS responses. That's about 70% of the responses that, uh, that firefighter paramedics go out on. So that, that's kind of the, the, the main thing. And the other is there's a specific body type or gender or something that, that is the magic sauce that, that, that makes a firefighter. And that's not really the case either. Being a firefighter is really about um, being committed to serving in your community and uh, great customer service. And we'll work on that, that fitness and strength and all those kinds of things, but it, it takes people of high character, strong work and work ethic. And that's what really is what gets you started on your career in the fire service. So obviously there are some, some bare minimum physical ability things you're going to have to be able to do in order to be a member of this team. Do you want to talk about those or do you just want people to apply and say, we'll, we'll cross that bridge when we get there? I think it's great to talk about. We, we run what's called the candidate physical ability test, and it doesn't test your ability to do the fire skills, but it is set up with things like dragging a dummy and lifting a ladder, and it's designed to, to see if you have the physical skills to learn the actual skills. And so um, you have a chance to come in, learn about the test, practice the test. We run a practice for about eight weeks. Um, so you can get yourself ready and um, before the academy starts, we also do like a pre-academy fitness program. And I, I tell anybody uh, the, the three things that you should do if you want to do this work is work on your cardiovascular health. That's, that's a great thing to do. Do things that use your large uh, muscles in your body, you know, using your entire body to make the most use of your um, whatever mass you have. And do things that um, make your hands strong, so holding on to things, lifting things. Those are the, the three parts of the physicality of the work that everything is built upon. Like I said, there is no doubt this is sparking a lot of imagination <laughs> for people watching. So what's the, well, the first and last place you want them to go to? It's, uh, it's the city website, and there's like a special join DMFD link. Is that right? Yeah, uh, dsm.city. On the front page is the firefighter recruitment. If you click on there, um, the application process, the whole story is there. But you can, uh, we have a video on the day in the life of a firefighter. We have all the information about compensation and benefits. Uh, we have uh, two tracks where if you're already a firefighter and paramedic, you can fill out the application one way. And if you're not, then you, you select the, the other side. 
but really um, we have a, it's a great resource. If you're thinking about it at all, go to the city's webpage and on the front page, click on the rec uh, recruitment link. And I think you'll be impressed with the, the amount of information that you'll learn about us that maybe you didn't know. Yeah, so just uh, apply and then go about getting into top to kip shape. Thanks, Chief, for uh, joining us this afternoon. Oh, you're welcome. Anytime.